previous session, we used observational science as applied to the dog kind. この観察科学を用いて私たちは犬の中の変化、品種を見ましたけれども、exactly、そしてそれは聖書の中に全ての生き物を種類に従って想像したというそれに当てはまること。それは決してあのダーウィンの言うような種類から種類に変わるというものではないこと。Uh, in, in そして次のセッションにおきましては化石のことを学びますけれども、layers, または地層processes, 私たちが地層のことを学ぶときに、そこには長い時間をかけて作られたというよりも短い時間に起こったということを私たちはかなり知ることができます。または私たち人間に焦点を当ててみたときに、それはいろんな人種がいるわけではなく、一つの人種しかいないということが実験科学でわかります。Now understand, none of this is ultimate proof that the Bible is right. これらは決して聖書の真実性を証明したという言い方ではないです。Because ultimately you can't scientifically prove anything absolutely in relation to the past. なぜならば過去誰も見たことのないものを誰も証明しえないからです。しかしそのことに私たちはかなり納得することができます。私たち、みんな有限なものでありますから、信仰によって生きるしかない部分というのは必ずあるのです。しかし私たちは盲目な信仰に立っているのではありません。私たちの今の事実を見て、そしてその中で学べば学ぶほど聖書の中の歴史観をそれはあかなり裏付けております。Right、ですから聖書を最初に持ってくること。So let's end off with a, a, a practical application of this and talk about、uh, life and DNA. ですからこれからしばらく命、特に DNA のことを見ていきたいと思います。I want to show you that observational science actually confirms the very first verse of the Bible. In the beginning, God created. この観察科学を学んでいくときに、聖書の言葉を、また聖書自身をとても納得させてくれます。You see, all of us can recognize the effect of intelligence. この偉大な能力を持っている方が、For instance, how did this building get here? 例えばこのビルディングを見てください。Well, I know what happened. 一体何が起こったんですか Japanese engineers got together. このエンジニアが日本人のエンジニアの人がみんな集まってですね And they put a load of bricks here. そこにはたくさんのブロックを積み上げた And then they exploded them. そしてそれらを爆発させた And look what happened. そしたらこういうものが建て,た建てられた isn't, isn't that great? 素晴らしいですね、そうだったら you don't believe that, do you? 誰も信じませんでしょ no, you know, そこには非常に賢い人たちがですね、エンジニアしたことを知ってるからです。In America, there is a mountain called Mount Rushmore. このマウン、えー、ラシモアという山がありますけれども And they have the president's heads there on Mount Rushmore. そこには以前の大統領の方々の顔が刻まれてますね。In fact, my favorite president, Abraham Lincoln. エイブラハム・リンカン、似てますね。How did, how did... The president's heads get there. Well, I have a theory. I think it's a very good one. Millions of years of wind and water erosion. The president's heads. そしてそれらが偶然にもこのような形になったということですね。You say that's ridiculous. Because we know that sculptors use their intelligence to, to carve the president's heads. So, we know that the president's heads are the president's heads. Let's face it, you can recognize the effect of intelligence. So, we know that the president's heads are the president's heads. If the Japanese didn't put intelligence into constructing their motor cars, you wouldn't sell them around the world. であのオートバイとかですね、素晴らしいもの、これはやはり日本の素晴らしい技術者のおかげです。Actually, put more intelligence into them than the Americans do, which is why you sell more than the Americans do. それはアメリカよりもさ,もうさらに良い技術を使っているからよく売れるんですね。You know what's interesting?Richard Dawkins can even see the evidence for intelligence. 
Here's a statement that Richard Dawkins, an ardent leading atheist, made. Yeah, you might say, it almost sounds like he believes in God. No, no because he's saying that evolution is the designer. But evolution is a concept. How can a concept design anything? But you know, you look at a building or you look at Mount Rushmore and you see the evidence of intelligence. But that's nothing compared to what we see when we look at DNA. A DNA cries out in the beginning God. DNA is that molecule of heredity that makes up our genes or the information that builds up. It was first studied by two scientists in England back in 1953. Uh, Watson and Crick came up with the structure of DNA. And this structure of DNA uh, is very, very complex. But these scientists believe that they'd shown that life was just chemistry. In fact, one of those scientists made this statement. See, they believe now that they'd uh, studied DNA, they could show, see, life is just chemistry, it's just molecules, that's it. Sort of sounds convincing, doesn't it? But, but since 1953, we know a lot more about DNA. DNA is much more than just chemistry. DNA is a molecule that's made up of lots of molecules. It's sort of like a piece of rope with beads representing molecules along that piece of rope. And all those molecules or beads write out all the information that will build a human or a dog or a cat or whatever. I'll give you an analogy. Uh, there is a universal code in the world called the Morse code. And it's a, a code that's done with dots and dashes. So you use beads representing dots and dashes on a rope and you can write words. But you can only write words if you know the code. If you don't know the code, you can't write the words. Now, if you typed out all the information that builds a human from our DNA, it's been estimated it would fill at least a thousand books each 500 pages each. Now now think it's much more than that. So your DNA is like a whole library of books of instruction on how to build you as a human. See, it's not just chemistry, it's books of information. Books of instruction. Much, much more complicated than, than the instructions on building a space shuttle. それはスペースシャトルを作る設計図よりもさらに複雑なものですね。Now, when I went to university, 